Hi everyone. In this video we will make a mini weather station for us. As you might know, I created this 10x10 RGB LED matrix that can display mesmerizing pictures and animations during a previous project video. And while it is certainly an eye catcher, I think it is a shame that once you upload your animations to the built-in Arduino Nano, you can only watch the LEDs going through the codes and not select your favorite light show whenever you want. That sounds like a job for the ESP8266 which is a microcontroller with built-in Wi-Fi that features 160 KB bytes of memory, 16 GPIO pins, SPI, I2C, I2S and ADC and much more. Seems like a suitable choice for our project, but recently, and with recently I mean in 2016, the successor of the ESP8266 was released, the ESP32. This one offers a higher clock speed, more memory, Bluetooth support, more GPIOs, DAC, and even sensors like a temperature, hole or touch sensor. So even though this microcontroller is definitely an overkill for my project upgrade, I will show you in this video how easy slash difficult it is to use such a microcontroller and in the end demonstrate how you can use it to control any kind of project through Wi-Fi. Let's get started. Let's switch to theft mode. The energy meter is bypassed by connecting input to the output. So the Caleb LED will no longer produce a pulse. Even though we consumed power, the controller will detect the load by measuring the current through the sensor. If the pulse is not detected within the threshold time, it means there is a power theft. After 10 seconds, the load will be turned off. Simultaneously, the theft data will be uploaded to the cloud. Circuitogram sketch and other details are available in the description. If you have any doubts in the project, leave them in the comment section below. 